Hi everyone, first lesson of the year. Maybe one of the most important for us Cajon players. Timing. My name is Felipe from CajonMaster.com and on this channel I make videos to help you improve as a Cajon player. I think everyone agrees that the best way to practice timing is with a metronome. But generally, when we practice to the metronome, we use that strong pose in quarter notes or eighth notes. Doing that, we end up leaning to the metronome instead of building an internal pulse or a solid timing. So today I'm going to show one of my favorite exercises to improve timing and build a strong internal clock. This exercise starts with four bars of groove at a higher tempo, let's say 160 BPM. Then four bars half of the tempo, 80 BPM. Then down to 40 BPM, then down to 20 BPM. And if you feel comfortable at 20 BPM, you can go down at 10 BPM. Let's see. 160 BPM is just the tempo I picked for this video. But of course you can choose any tempo and go down in halves. You can choose any groove for this exercise. The goal here is to play a groove with the same tempo, but of course with longer gaps between each click. You see that it starts to be more difficult, especially when you go to the slower tempos. I suggest you that you really take the time to practice each tempo individually, to then try the exercise. This exercise will show if we are really playing on time. So let's see how it goes. It's not easy. This is an exercise that it's always in my practice routine. When, for example, I'm learning a new groove, this I think it's a great way to check if I integrate it well. If I can play it with a bigger gap between clicks. So that's all for today. I hope this exercise will improve your timing and build your internal clock. I have included some metronome app suggestions in the description below in case you need. And if you want to take your Cajon playing to the next level, I invite you to join my online Cajon school at cajonmaster.com. There's a lot of free stuff for you to get started. So go there and check it out. If you enjoyed this lesson, hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe to the channel. I will see you very soon in the next video. Thanks for watching. Bye.